What has dialysis done for me? How has it made my life harder? And what gifts has it given me? First and foremost, dialysis is not a cure. Dialysis really doesn't replace a kidney. Rather, it copies the function of a kidney. It does an okay job, but not a great job. If I were to give dialysis a score, I would give it a D. It's just enough to pass the class of life. The A's and B's and C's go to real kidneys. But you're still passing your class and you're able to enjoy the experience of being alive. Dialysis did not cure my lack of energy due to anemia. I have to get iron shots to fix that. And though I do have more energy than I did when I was in stage four and stage five of kidney disease, that energy that I have is not consistent. And often if I overdo it, it will take me days to recover. And that lack of consistent energy frustrates me. And I hate that I am not able to be consistent. Dialysis is not easy. And no matter what form of dialysis you choose to do, it takes up a lot of time. It's uncomfortable and often painful. I don't get great sleep anymore. I have medication that helps me with that, but every night there is a machine running in the background. And now that I'm on dialysis, I do have a little more freedom of my diet because I'm no longer trying to desperately prolong the life of my kidneys. I can't eat willy nilly like I used to be able to do. And it's hard for me to find food that I feel safe eating if it was prepared by someone else. So eating out is worrisome for me and often I just don't go so I don't have the stress of it. I'm unable to go swimming, to soak in a hot tub, or to even take my own bath. I worry about getting in serious life-threatening infections and I am more susceptible to getting ill. Life is a little more stressful and complicated and there's a lot to worry about. I still have a lot of doctor appointments that I have to go to and I get a lot of shots and that just takes up a lot of time. Because I do peritoneal dialysis at home, there is a wall in my bedroom that is full of dialysis boxes. I have a closet full of supplies and I create a lot of garbage. Being on dialysis makes traveling harder. Preparations need to start earlier and, and there's a lot more supplies and baggage that you have to take along with you. So life is a little less spontaneous. But dialysis has brought me life. Dialysis has kept my potassium, phosphorus, and sodium within a safe range. Dialysis does remove the toxins and extra fluid from my body so that they don't build up and make me sick. I don't have constant headaches or feel nauseous anymore. I don't have itchy skin, nor does my weight fluctuate due to fluid retention. Dialysis has removed the brain frog that I suffered from as my kidneys were failing. And that was really frustrating and debilitating. I gained back 15 pounds of body muscle, which I had lost. So I feel stronger now, I'm able to work, and I'm able to be helpful, which is important to me. The hair that I lost going through kidney failure started to grow back once I started dialysis. And it grew back curly, which I have no idea what to do with it, but hey, it's an adventure. I also have a lot of my energy back. I'm able to go on walks and hikes and do the activities that I want to do. They just sometimes take me longer and I have to space them out. Dialysis has given me time to spend with the people I love and care about. Without dialysis, I wouldn't have been able to see my children graduate high school, start college, and to watch them grow up to be their own people. And to me, that time is priceless. And it brings me such joy and fulfillment in my life. I get to visit family and friends for the holidays and they get to come and visit me when I originally thought that I was going to be chained down to a dialysis clinic. I've experienced generosity and kindness towards me and my family that surprised me and overwhelmed me, especially when that kindness was shown towards my children. Going through this trial has brought my family closer together and my children have become more compassionate and they're more aware of those around them that are struggling and they look for opportunities to help. Having gone through this experience taught me to 
not wait for the perfect time or a better moment because sometimes those don't happen and the best time is now. It's made me more grateful for the little things. Things matter less and people matter more. And I feel like I'm able to express my love and gratitude more deeply. Being on dialysis has really slowed me down and it's made me think, what do I really want to leave behind in this world? And that has given me a sort of peace that I haven't felt before. Going through kidney failure is tremendously difficult but it has changed me into a better person. And that change only happened because I went through hard things. I don't think I'll ever be able to say I am grateful that I went through kidney failure, but I can say I am grateful for the person I am now because I am able to see purpose, blessings, and beauty in my struggles. I've heard the phrase kidney warrior for those who have gone through or are suffering from kidney disease or kidney failure, but I don't feel like a warrior. I don't have big thick armor or big muscles. And if something pushes against me, I most likely will fall down. But hopefully after a while of probably feeling sorry for myself, I'll get back up and try to find the strength to move forward. And I hope that you also will be able to find the strength to get back up and take a step forward. And that you'll be able to find beauty and purpose in your own life. Thanks for listening.